good evening ladies and gentlemen boys and girls welcome to the one month leadership camp and challenge by lead or led by and this is an initiative by edufam international academy a academy that believes in self management in personal development in personal training and an academy that provides equal opportunity to all the sections of the society so this is our orientation program and in this program we are going to start with self introduction within 30 seconds it's itself is a really challenge for all of us but let's see that who is going to meet this challenge who is going to accept the challenge and who is going to introduce within 30 seconds so now house is open to you all okay so let's begin with aisha tazeen with a good evening everyone this is aisha tazeen indian by origin but saudi arabia based since last 25 years i am a teacher by profession aspiring to become vice principal from this program i hope to become a fine tuned leader who will be leading the school and taking it to a next higher level inshallah thank you so much inshallah aisha alvira hello good evening everyone first of all thank you for giving a opportunity to introduce myself my name is alvira afroz lagakutta i am basically from india i am born and raised in near pasapan maharashtra i have uh, i have uh, i have recently given my jsc board examination from this leading program i want to learn to be strong but not rude be kind but not weak be humble but not uh, be humble but not timid be arrogant but no be proud but not arrogant and at last i i want to have humor but not but without uh yes alvira thank you and now next we have uh, uh next we are going to invite where is madam adyinka madinat adyinka madinat now you can in introduce yourself hello hello dear yes go ahead okay my name is adyinka madinat so i'm from nigeria i'm from crescent school and my expectation in this uh, seminar is to become a leader with a great uh, opportunity to train uh, to train other colleagues and to be able to be a team leader to realize my goal and to uh, to realize my god given uh, potentials and utilize it in a way that it will be beneficial to my learners that I'm teaching and to the society and to also develop my skills to be a better person so that's what i am expecting to be uh, to gain in this uh, edufan thank you thank you very much Hello. and now next we have dr anara assalamu alaikum hello everyone i am anara naim i am from maldives uh now i am working as yeah. an author lawyer and mental health advocate from maldives uh i hope this program uh i can learn uh, many leadership skills i want to thank the organizer of this program and uh, thank you all beautiful now we have evangelina yes evangelina go ahead Great evening, everyone. This is Evangeline from Edifam International Academy, and I am uh, an Indian uh, by birth, and uh, I am uh, studying at uh, Nimla College for Women, uh, doing my final year in BSc Physics. Thank you. Thank you, Evangeline, and it's my turn. So, hello, everyone. My name is Halima Sadia. That's what my parents have named me as. Whether I like, I don't like, but it is my name, Doctor Halima Sadia. Doctor, I have added by earning PhD. and uh, i by profession i am a teacher by passion i am a human lover you know people are animal lovers but i am human lover i love all the human being in whatever form they are whether they are kid small big women men whosoever they are i love them and that's why i want to be with them originally i am from india but i am living right now i live in maldives and i love maldives 
an open invitation to you all to visit Maldives. And from this session, I'm going to learn a lot. Thank you very much, Rihanna, for showing me the card. Okay, now next is Khadija. Khadija Sajda. Oh, she has gone for the prayer. That's what she said. Okay, so now let's move to, there are many people with M. So let's move to Rehan, Mohammed Rehan. Uh, Mohammed Rehan, are you there? Yes, yes. Uh, hello, everyone. Can you hear me? Yes, we can. Yeah, my name is Rehan. I stay in Navi Mumbai and uh, I'm MBA marketing. From this course, I learned a lot and uh, almost three, four batches I have joined. And in every batch, I learned something new. And uh, apart from these things, I really love to interact with Dr. Halima, who is really hardworking and taking care of uh, youth. And uh, the, the, the program is designed in such a way that uh, we not only learning the leadership, we are learning hard to... Oh, oh, red card, Rehan, red card. Thank you. Now next, we will move to Malik Taiba. Assalamu alaikum and good evening everyone. This is Malik. I'm basically from Jammu and Kashmir, but right now residing at Delhi. Uh, so this is also my second batch with Halima ma'am. Yes. Uh, what I am going to get from this one batch is being open, being more creative, positive change, taking responsibility, being passionate and focus that others can look up to help all you stand apart from others. Literally that I want this time ma'am <laughs> and shine to make myself shine as a leader. Yes, thank you. Thank you, Malik. Now next is thank Neha. You, Neha, please tell us about you. Yeah, good evening. This is me, Parveen. I'm, I'm Indian and I'm basically from Katak, Orissa. And I just uh, want to learn this uh, leadership skills as to improve my leadership style. And I want to develop my communication skills and the mastering the art of the leadership so that I can become more confident as a leader and find new ways to influence the teams which I will lead. So I just want to learn the ability of the leaders. A oh, woman can oh red that. card, red card, Neha. So now we move to Nara Subramaniam from Malaysia. Good evening, everyone. My name is uh, Nara Subramaniam. I'm a chartered accountant in Kuala Lumpur, Malaysia, with more than four decades of service. Over the last 10 years, I have coached more than thousands of employees and hundreds of SMEs, business people around the world. I'm here to help you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, Nara. Now next, Rahul. Hello, everyone. I'm Rahul Patti, and I'm basically from India. Maharashtra, Pune. Uh, so yes, I am an engineer by profession and trainer by heart. Uh, I have like a 16 years of experience in automotive field. And recently, like four years back, I moved uh, into the training field, sharing my knowledge with the young, youngsters, as well as the uh, people who are like struggling with their finances, personal finances mainly. So yes, and I am I'm an author as well. My book is Grow Rich Movement, and I'm on the mission to help individuals. Exactly on time. Thank you. Exactly on time, Rahul. And now, Rihanna. And for Rihanna, Rahul is going to see the timing. Hi, everyone. I'm Rihanna here. Uh, I'm from Singapore, and uh, I'm a mindset coach. I've been training since 2011, and uh, my a lot of my work is in youth. Uh, but I do adult training as well, corporate training as well, uh, more on uh, emotional well-being as well, and uh, to be able to empower people. Thank you. Oh, oh, within time, Rihanna, thank you. And now next we have Shabana. Hello, good evening, everyone. My name is Shabana Kosar. Basically, I am from Hyderabad, India the city famous for biryani and hospitality. And uh, basically by profession, I'm a teacher and a school principal. And from this course, I would learn uh, how to accept the challenges because after pandemic, school are suffering. And I'm on uh, like uh, to give a quality education for the students and daily we face challenges. So this course definitely helped me to how to face the challenges, how to get the solution from that. 
So thank you so much. <laughs> thank you, Shabana. Thank you very much. And now we have Sana. Hello, good evening, everyone. Uh, my name is Sana Ashmi. I live in uh, New Delhi. Uh, I am a postgraduate uh, trained teacher. Fortunately, last year I have contributed my service uh, as an academic head uh, in one of the leading schools in South Delhi. Uh, and uh, from this leadership course, I am sure I will be able to develop my uh, abilities, my skills, my confidence, and uh, I will become a uh, 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 a big a big personality <laughs> one day inshallah and unbeatable leader thank you so much oh, oh red card was given to sana no problem sana and uh, now we have the last in the house who is sayada faiza sayada faiza may i know you sayada faiza may i know you Sayada Faiza, because there is no candidate in our list named Sayada Faiza, neither the mentor nor. She says she's Sadika. Sadika. Oh, oh, she is Sadika. Please rename. Otherwise, then I will send you in the waiting room and you will keep on waiting. Okay, Sadika, please introduce yourself. Sadika, apne baraye bataiye. Okay, Sadhika, we understood that you have joined from sister's phone and I have renamed you. I have written your name here. Now, please let us know. Speak up. Unmute yourself and speak up. Okay, so I think uh, Sadhika has some issues. Let's move to Ruhi. Ruhi Parveen from Khatak. Assalamu alaikum. My name is Rohi Parveen. I am an art and craft teacher. I live in Katak. Thank you. Uh, very good, Rohi. And next time I request you all when we, there are like proper sessions going on, you all have to switch on your video because only the session, uh, the resource person can feel confident and the resource person can deliver in a proper way. So you can switch on your video in the proper sessions. If you can do now also, it is better. Thank you very much, Ruhi, for sharing your introduction. And now we'll move to Zia, Dr. Zia. Uh, good evening, everyone. I'm Dr. Zia Punekar. I'm PhD in civil engineering. I have taught in many universities back in India and Bahrain and UAE. I'm a trainer and a motivator. Thank you very much. Okay, thank you, Dr. Zia, for your beautiful introduction. And now we are welcoming Dr. Zeba. Now the person who is coming late, what we are supposed to do, we all have to say together, good evening, Zeba, but not now, she's still connecting. Once she is there, Please unmute yourself and everybody say together. Okay, one, two, three. Unmute everyone and say good evening. Well, good evening. 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 Dr. Zeba, introduce yourself, please. Uh, Asalaamu Alaikum. I'm Dr. Zeba and uh, I'm working as assistant professor in Maldives National University. And uh, I love to know myself and be more confident about my work uh, from this program. Yeah. Thank you very much. And now, ladies and gentlemen, I think everybody has introduced. Uh, who is this M? Okay, she is Malik Taba. Malik Taba, will you please write your name so that I will not be confused all the time that who is M? No, she wrote already. Okay, okay, sorry, it is there, yes. Okay, now may I request Evangelina to please just note down the participants' name and take their attendance so that yes, you can catch them, those who are not present, because officially there should be 19 participants in this meeting room. 19 uh, joinees. 
and then mentors are there. Mentors are separate. There are six mentors. See, now Dr. Ram is coming. What you are supposed to do? Tell me quickly. What we are going out, to out, uh, good, evening, good evening, Dr. Dr. Ram. Good evening, Dr. Ram. Not now. Once, <laughs> not now. Let him join the audio. Otherwise, it is not audible. Once let him join the audio, then we will say. Where is he? he has gone. He's gone. We lost him. Uh oh, he has gone. I think oh, he, he, he already knew him. about it. <laughs> <laughs> it seems that he knew that we are going to do this. So that's why he left. Yes. So now, please, ladies and yes. gentlemen. He's back. He's back. He's back. Okay. One, two, three. Good evening, Dr. Ram. Please introduce yourself, Dr. Ram. Hello. You know, yeah. Hello. I'm, I'm still outside. Please yeah. introduce yourself. Do you want me to speak? Introduce yes. yourself in 30 seconds. I am myself. I am Dr. Ram. I am the founder and managing director of AC International Red Limited Singapore. Uh, thank you for giving me an opportunity for this uh, leader led by challenges for one month, especially for women empowerment strategies to give the support for all the wonderful women. Thank you. Thank you, Dr. Ram. May I know who is Fatima Khan? Ah, Fatima Khan. Fatima Khan? Yes, Assalamu alaikum Assalam. Are you the participant? Yeah, uh, like I joined from another e email ID. So my name is Fatima Sajda Khanam. Okay, you are Sajda, yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Go ahead with the introduction. Okay, so I'm I hail from Odisha, and I'm pursuing a MBA. So I am passionate about uh, gardening and experimenting with food, and uh, plater presentation. I love animals. So I'm a jovial person and even a sportive person. I love to play games. Uh, yeah, that's all about me. Uh, thank you, Sajda. Thank you very much. If Khadija is back, Khadija, you can introduce yourself. Khadija, are you back? Ji, Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuhu. Alaikum assalam. Ji, uh, I'm Khadija Sajda Khanam, currently working as working uh, assistant professor in Maulana Azad National Urdu University, which is located at Qatar from Odisha. Thank you for giving the chance, introducing myself. And thank you for organizing such a wonderful session. Thank you. Thank you very much. Now, ladies and gentlemen, let me know your energy level. Please give out of 10 you to yourself marks in the chat box. What is your energy level at this time? At this time, your energy level is at what level? 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 2. Oh, oh, so Aisha is on 10, Anna is on 10, Nara Sar is on 10. And what about others? Where is your energy level? Come on and let us know your energy level. Wow, very much. Okay. Thank you very much. So now let me begin with a beautiful story. The story is about a girl. She is Reshma. You all can meet Reshma. Reshma is very ambitious, very enthusiastic, and Reshma wanted to be a great entrepreneur. And she wanted to be successful in life. And for that, she has started doing the things on her own. She has taken everything in her own hand. She has started uh, watching the videos, reading the books, and she has started doing the research so that she can become an entrepreneur. But it was not possible for her because she was in a mess. She was not able to understand that from where she has to start and uh, from scratch, how to start? Because she was just a fresher, a new graduate. And then she thought of taking the help from the mentor. And then she went to Karan. Karan was a great, successful businesswoman who has established many, many, uh, many, many uh, businesses. And that's why, under the guidance of Karan, Reshma learned the ins and outs of starting and running a successful business. And then Karan was a great mentor. Karan taught her everything about the business. And very soon, Reshma was dancing happily because her business became 
the great business and she became a successful entrepreneur in life. But what happened? That is not the end of the story. You all must be thinking that, that is the end of the story. No. Then what happened that after a few years, <laughs> have you all noticed in your own life that when we start any doing anything, immediately you will find that someone else has also started doing the same? Have you, have you experienced this? I have experienced yes. many yes. others. If I start doing me and mom quiz, then I found many people are doing me and my mom quiz. Then I started doing rainbow camp for the students. I saw that many other people are starting doing the rainbow camp. Then I started leadership uh, uh, challenge. Then I found that many people are doing the challenges. So it happens. When you start anything, you will find that many people are coming into the same arena. And many we people... So question is not only in Nigeria. Uh, will you please mute her, uh, Evangelina? Then there was a competitor and then very soon the competitor has uh, captured the market and uh, then Reshma didn't know how to compete. And then, you know, once you are puzzled, once you are in uh, stressful, you start making the mistakes and then your mistakes will take you even back. And then your mistakes will not allow you to move further. And the same thing happened with Reshma, that Reshma started making more mistakes and then going back. Then Reshma realized that, okay, this moment when she is feeling lost and helpless, again, she contacted Karan and then there Karan has, Reshma has narrated her whole story. And then Karan proved herself as a great mentor and she has given a new strategy and provided her with all the tools that was helpful for her to regenerate the business and restart uh, her endeavor and to compete with a competitor in the field. And then once again, Reshma was flourishing, Reshma was happy and Reshma achieved her goal. So ladies and gentlemen, that is the end of the story of Reshma with Karan. Now tell me, what did you learn from this story? What is your learning from this story? Write in the chat box one or two lines, whatever you think is essential. Whatever you have learned from this story, the story of Reshma and Karan. Please write in the chat box. I am waiting for your responses. The story of Reshma and the story of Karan. Oh, oh, so never give up, learn from the mistakes, very good. Not to take granted any, not to granted any, Swiss. Uh, Zeba, will you please explain this? We need to have a mentor to guide us, very good. Then women empowering women, wow, that's really wonderful. Take a mentor. We need to get the right help. A mentor or a guide. Very good. Never give up. Fatigue is just okay. That is something else. Then uh, through we have experience in our field, but we may need guided practices to move forward. What do you always put in your best to achieve the best over others? Thank you very much for your learnings. Reshma started right after learning, went through changes. She was not afraid of afraid to ask and found the right person to help. Karan was generous to share. Thank you very much. Such beautiful learnings are there. These are the pearls of wisdom that I have learned today and that I think that is going to be my takeaway from this session. Thank you very much for sharing your learnings from the story of Reshma and Karan. And I don't know who is Reshma, who is Karan, but I believe that you all are Karan for me and I am Reshma at this moment. Thank you. Now let's move further that what we are going to learn in this course, that is one month leadership challenge. So here we go. Put your hands together to welcome our one month leadership challenge.
in this challenge, you are going to be in the lead house. That is the first information you should have. Everybody, all the mentors and all the participants are going to be in the lead house for one month, starting from 1st May to 30th May. So you will be called the residence of lead house. And then you will be getting the information, the rules, the regulations that how to behave in the lead house because every house has their own rules and regulations and we have to follow that. Similarly, lead house has the rules and regulations. And out of that, the first and foremost is to respect each and every residence of the house, their belief, their, uh, their belief system, their religion, their culture, their nationality, everything we have to respect and we should always take care that this is a global house. This is not, this house doesn't belong only to one nation or one country. So in this global house, we have the people from different countries that we have to respect them and we have to regard them. Then in this house, your day will start at six o'clock in the morning. And first thing that you have to do is that you have to welcome the world with a beautiful smile. You are occupying the space in this world. You don't have any right to spoil the world's mood early morning by saying, oh my God, again Monday? Again, I have to go to office? No, you don't have any right to do that. You have to be smiling. Thank God, Alhamdulillah. One more day for me to prove, one more day for me to love, one more day for me to show the world, one more day for me to go to the people, to hug them, to love them, to embrace them, to make them powerful and to be powerful ourselves. So this is the first thing that you are supposed to do at six o'clock. And religiously you have to do, don't expect that we are going to peep in your houses and see that whether you are smiling or not smiling. And don't expect that we are going to ask you to click photograph of smiling face and then upload. It has to be on your own. You all have to do it. Then the second, second thing you have to do is that you have to be thankful to God. First thing to, you have to utter the word from your mouth is, that thank you, Allah, thank you, Almighty, thank you, Lord, thank you, Bhagwan, thank you, uh, God, whosoever you are believing in, you have to say thank you early morning. And we have to be grateful, thankful that we are blessed with a new day, one more day, 24 more hours. This is the second thing that is expected in the lead house. Then the third thing is that you have to uh, do your daily affirmations. Daily affirmation, first day we are going to uh, upload so in the morning at six o'clock. Six o'clock means IST six o'clock. Everybody can calculate their own time. In Maldives, it will be 5.30. In Singapore, it is going to be eight, uh, nine o'clock. So accordingly, first day it will be given to you. You have to repeat the affirmation in your voice because text will be given and voice will be given both. So you have to repeat the same affirmation in your voice and then you have to uh, share in the WhatsApp group. And you have to listen to minimum three friends that is compulsory. Listen to the affirmations of three friends and then you upload your own affirmation. But next day onwards, like second May onwards, you are supposed to bring your own affirmations and the one who is going to upload the first, that is going to be the leader of the day, the early risers and then believe uh, you, you must know that the house will not remain open all the time to uploading. It will open exactly at six o'clock. So you have to keep your affirmation ready, maybe in some other uh, folder so that you just copy and paste immediately once the house is open, then only you can be the leader of the day. So this is, that's what we call that early morning. We have, we need your 10 minutes time for this mm -hmm. ritual that we have to do every day. Then after that, in the and that ritual has to be done in the WhatsApp. This, this uh, affirmation has to be done through the WhatsApp group in the lead house. Then after that, um, you will be getting challenge and the challenge will be sometimes in the form of video and sometimes in the form of articles, sometimes in the form of a link of any other, uh, from other websites. So these challenges you will get latest by seven o'clock. Yani between six to seven, you will receive this challenge. But for this challenge, Doing the challenge, completing the challenge, you will have full day time. Before 8 o'clock, like 8 p.m. when we are going to have the session, before that, we all have to complete our challenge and then come for the session. If you are not submitting by that time, then you will not get the points for this. That we have to keep in mind that we have to complete the challenge every day before 8 p.m. Better whenever you are receiving, immediately you can do it. And then we will be 
uh, attending the evening sessions at 8 p.m. 8 p.m. again is India time. We all can calculate our time, Maldives 7.30, and other Singapore, it is going to be. Uh, what is the time now over there? It is 11 o'clock. Now, how you are going to get, gain the scores? Daily affirmation will have 10 points. Challenge will have 20. Uh, challenge one is for the completion, and one is to share the affirmation on the social media. We will give you the platform that where you have to share your, your reflection on the challenge. So that's why it is divided between 10 and 10. Then evening session, if you are attending the evening session, you will get 20 points. So total it is 50 points fixed for everyone. Now, how you are going to get the bonus? Because if everybody is getting uh, these 50 points, then how we are going to decide that who is the champion, who has scored the maximum marks? For that, there are bonus system. So leader of the day will get 10 points. Like if you are the first one who has uploaded the affirmation in with the text and voice both, both should come, text also, voice also, then you will get 10 points extra. And then uh, like 10 points will be for the daily affirmation, but for leader will have additional 10 points. So leader will get 20 points. Then if you are asking question answers in the evening session, you will get five for each questions. Like evening session should not be just a listening session, but we have to contribute. That's why question answers and the for contribution or for participation from the participant, five points are given. And then I told you that you have to write your reflection on the challenge on the social media. And on that, if you are commenting, like suppose your friend has uh, written the reflection, like Shabana has written the reflection. And I'm going and commenting on that, whether it is like positive uh, criticism or negative criticism, or it is appreciation, it is a motivational uh, line that I have written for her, I will get one marks for writing the motivational line for her. So in this way, everybody has to motivate each other because for motivating others, for commenting on others post, you are getting the points. That is the main concept. So in this way, this is the marking. Now, when you are the leader of the day, you, your uh, poster will be like this for that particular day. And that will be uploaded in the group and on the social media as well with the, your photograph. And if you are comfortable with the photograph, then only we will do. If you are not comfortable with the photograph, we are not going to have your photograph because there are certain participants. They told me that they don't want their photograph. So no problem. We will not upload your photograph. But yes, your name will be there that you are the leader of the day with the date it will be there, that on which day, who is the leader of the day. Now, next, this is the list of the participants. You all can see that uh, these many participants are there and all are from different, different places, different, different countries, different, different cultures. And we have divided them into different groups. It's important for you to understand your group mates so that you can work with them in the group. So here we have uh, alpha group. In the alpha group, we have Dr. Anara, Aisha Tazin will be the coordinator. Then Madinat uh, Bolanle will be the um, uh, participant and Dr. Abeda will be uh, again another participant in this. Then uh, Sarius group, we have Shabana Kosar at coordinator, Dr. Zebun Nahar, Aisha Shifaza and Binita Sarkar. So today, Aisha Shifaza and Vinita, both of them I couldn't see. I will just find out where are they and why they couldn't join today. Then in the third group, the third group's name is uh, Regal Group. Can you tell me why we I have taken these names? What are the names of these, like Alpha, Regal, Ceres, Viga? Can you tell me that these names represents what? Ma'am, these Omit are stars, meteors. constellation. Constellation, constellation stars. Very good. So you are the stars. That's why we have selected these names for the groups. So in the regal group, we have Malik Taiba as coordinator, Rizwana Khan, Sayeda Sadeka, Neha Parveen, and Alvira Afroz. And mentor is Rehana, ma'am. And uh, uh, then we have uh, Vega um, group. In the Vega, we have Sana Hashmi as coordinator, and Khadija, Reshma, Fatma, and Rui as participants. And I will be mentoring this. Then Dr. Ram will be mentoring this. We have not included uh, Rahul so far and Mahindran because their timings, I was not sure that how much time they will be able to um, designate for this. They will be, if they are available, you can contact them also. We will provide you their phone numbers as well, their contact details, WhatsApp number, so that you can contact them as well, Mr. Mahindran and Mr. Uh, Rahul. Since they are very busy and Mahindran has 12 hours time difference because he is in USA. So uh, we were not very sure that how much we can coordinate with him. 
as uh, as for timing is concerned maybe he is sleeping at 2 o'clock and someone of is sending the message oh you are my mentor please solve my this issue and then he is <laughs> disturbed in the sleep that's why we have not considered him in this so in this way we are going to work in that group and uh, you all know that our uh, rule is that if somebody has not performed the task in the group the whole group gets zero you may be thinking that it is very cruel it is rude when very harsh but we have to because you know leadership is taking the people along if one word i will say for leadership who is leader in in your surroundings you say in your companies you see in your house you see in the market you see everywhere you see the person who is not just concerned about himself but about others is a leader the one who is taking everybody along with him is a leader so this is the first and foremost responsibility of the leader to to take everybody along with him or her so that's why if anybody from your group is not doing the task everybody will get zero on that day so ensure that every participant of your group is active and they are doing the task that is very very important for all of us now coming to the topics now let me explain these awards by the completion of this course like after one month uh, if you have completed 80% and above task you will get the completion certificate but if anybody has not completed the task and simply they have taken the admission by paying certain minimum amount so i'm thinking that we will get a certificate so they will not get the certificate the past evidences are there that our pass rate is 30% in all our camps i don't know in this camp how it is going to change uh, i am very much hopeful that this uh, this batch is going to change this percentage from 30% to 100% that i am expecting from this batch because all of you are very very uh, ambitious very hard working and you all are uh, very sincere so 80% work you will do and get the certificate of completion and if you complete 100% task then you will get one more certificate of appreciation that you have completed 100% task then one winner will get a winner trophy the big trophy will be given to the one person in the whole camp that will be the uh, uh, winner of the challenge of leadership so that is called winner's trophy to one topper and then apart from that we will get the medals medals for the most effective leader most helpful leader most charismatic leader most punctual leader and most communicative leader and all these will be uh, selected by the mentors because they will be observing you this most effective to most communicative there is no parameter like there is no uh, a marking system for this it all depends on the mentors so they will be observing you throughout the month and then they will recommend that for which title you are suitable whether you should you deserve a title or you don't deserve a title and then you will be getting a medal for this so this is your beautiful lead house wait till tomorrow so that you can get uh, the first challenge tomorrow inshallah and now let me just quickly show you that how you are going to record your work whatever work you are going to do how you are going to maintain the tasks and how you are going to ensure that you are completing your task so everybody is going to get a journal this time okay uh, is my screen visible yes yes ma'am so you will be getting this through google drive and once you receive this please don't start writing in this you make a copy and then write okay and you can write your name here there is a space of writing the name so that we can check your work every on daily basis that how you are doing your work okay so this journal is going to be with you here we have given all the modules there are six modules and each module have certain sessions that also we have mentioned and who is going to take which module that is also mentioned here and then day wise also routine we have written here that who is going to take first day second day third day with your topics with your mentor's name all the information is there in this journal so there is no problem of any confusion everybody is very clear who is going to do what and then you will get 30 pages like this so day one my reflection reflection is always about the challenge because when you are receiving the challenge you don't know how to do it so everybody is doing as per their own understanding but when you come in the session then the mentor is going to tell you that how it was supposed to be done and whether you have done in the right direction this is the perfect way of doing or we can have other ways also of doing then you can write your reflections here after attending the session 
that okay i did this and it was my experience like this and then my mentor has uh, taught me in this way whatever way and then notes will always be the learnings from the sessions in the evening we have the sessions from the sessions the important points you can always write down here so there are two things to be done every day my reflections on the challenge this is about the challenge mm. and my notes about the session evening session so in this way it will continue till 30 days all 30 days you will get these 30 pages are there and once you complete these 30 pages then at the end you will get a page for the scoring so that you can score for yourself directly and then you can share your score with your coordinator and coordinator will be sending to us weekly basis not daily basis so coordinator will keep you will send daily basis through the coordinator coordinator will compile and send to us uh, evangelina is going to uh, coordinate this evangelina is our uh, uh, we can say he, she is the our she is our production manager of this whole course so she is going to be the key person for contacting for this type of work so you have to send to the coordinators have to send to evangelina and then likewise you have to give your marks day one day two day three day four and marks can be calculated on the basis of this i hope that we all are mature enough and honest enough to give ourselves marks as per our contributions not simply anything or any uh, whatever you like then 30 days marks you will put in this and then once you complete everything then you don't forget to congratulate yourself that you have completed this task now only one thing is left that i have to give you the link of the social media where you are supposed to post your reflection like whatever reflection you are writing here same reflection you have to post in the social media this reflection okay and then on 29th day we are going to check your journal this notebook and then on the basis of this we are going to give you the marks if it is 80 percent then you will get the certificate inshallah so that's all from me i hope that everything is very clear to you if there is any problem if there is any issues and if there is a confusion you are not able to understand you are most welcome to ask the questions please so morning will it be on whatsapp and evening is it on uh, zoom uh, on zoom okay yeah like like today we are sitting here in the same same session will be there but all the mentors will not be there every day only one mentor will be there and i will be there every day uh, if possible now we have mahendran with, uh, with us mahendran we have introduced ourselves in 30 seconds you also can introduce yourself within 30 seconds please mr mahendran are you there yes dr harima am i audible visible yes yes you are audible visible please uh, let us know about you all right great uh, happy evening uh, everyone i'm super happy excited you know along with the dr halima and uh, all the amazing mentors across the world we are here to bring this uh, unique experience to each of you you could uh, definitely now note down this particular month uh, the life till now life here now life here after and it's going to be the best of the best uh, and i'm sure like you know come with that prepared mind you know uh, it's like you know the the uh, land which is really really you know uh, ready to grow its abundance yeah so how we really uh, bring that you know massive uh, inner transformation that's how we are going to see it outside so with that note yeah this is mahindran mahindran periyasami i currently live in uh, washington dc the uh, capital city near uh, uh, i mean in uh, united states of america I'm basically from uh, a place called trichy uh, in uh, tamil nadu and i've always been migrating you know and i was uh, you know and then i completed my studies in pondicherry uh, central university then i did my uh, uh, masters in computer science uh, then uh, business administration uh, psychotherapy and counseling and uh, various other things and uh, completed around you know 10 plus different uh, certifications i'm a coach a marathon coach um, uh, uh, international executive coach and uh, bringing transforming lives with the electrifying results and uh, yes this is not just uh, my uh, profession it's a passion and how we can really transform lives and uh, we all are you know meant to live our 
great version of our life the best of the best version of our life and how we can really you know bring it and uh, the the best part about you know being in this coaching journey is like you know uh, you are a lifetime student and you are uh, working with a lifetime student and you know with this amazing uh, you know team of uh, mentors we are here you know bringing this unique uh, uh, experience to each of you so just come with a open mind and uh, the kind of uh, the fresh uh, book whereas you know you would be a author for yourself yeah you'll be uh, authoring your own life in a way that you know how amazingly powerfully we can really you know bring out and uh, just uh, come with the 100% just a uh, simple formula i wanted to give and then you know i'll just pass on to dr halima uh, it's a code of honor i want you, each of you to set some code of honor or uh, to give your 100% commitment 100% ownership 100% responsibility it's called cor yeah cor and i'm sure each of you will come and then uh, stay committed we are uh, committing for your success are you committing for your success is the question yeah with that note i'll just uh, pass on um, back to dr halima thank you uh, thank you very much we have received a question that uh, uh, yeah what is uh, affirmation okay so can anyone would like to answer or i can give an example yeah ma'am will you please give me the opportunity if you want uh, you means aisha 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 ma'am dr aisha yes dr aisha go ahead yeah thank you ma'am uh, affirmation and dear all ladies and gentlemen affirmation is that positive note that we give to ourselves or give to anyone affirm means to stay positive and to be positive all those statements which will energize and motivate ourselves are the affirmations we are we are affirming ourselves that is what i understood ma'am okay thank you very much uh, if my screen is visible you all can see that here there is a written form today's affirmation like this is for the previous group i am showing you from that group so these are the affirmations i am in charge of my life i have the power to make my dreams true so all these affirmations are there same thing we have to record in the Good morning words. my dear friends today's affirmation i am in charge of my life i have the power to make my dreams true i believe in myself and my abilities good things are going to come to me i matter my confidence grows when i step outside of my comfort zone my positive thoughts create positive feelings today i will walk through my challenges person, uh, like ishan has recorded that so you will see that same thing even asna will be saying the same good morning friends today's affirmation i am in charge of my life i have the power to make my dreams true i believe in myself and my abilities good things are going to come to me i matter so one person is going to a uh, uh, text like paste this text in the group and with the voice the other people if you are not the leader you are not the first one then all have to follow that that is the main concept So actually, that the people try actually, to do the first one. Yes, actually, uh, affirmation is a kind of promise that we do to ourselves. Yes, early morning we do it with ourselves that how we are going to be throughout the day, and uh, this pop. I start like this affirmation. I came to know maybe about four years ago, but before that. uh one thing uh, one uh, i attended one uh, workshop and there i was taught that early morning when you are taking the shower uh, when you are under the shower you just pour water on they especially said that on the neck and then you just say yourself that i can do it i can do it it's possible it's not difficult and then you will find that throughout the day you are very positive and everything seems to be easy for you and you can compete uh, in the life's challenges so these type of things like every day if we are saying there is a very famous uh, uh, research also that there was a plant and everybody was abusing that plant the, the plant did not grow even the plant died but there was a plant which was appreciated every day the even plant grows faster and in a, in a very beautiful way so if we say good things about ourselves every day so we become good gradually and we have positive energy in us so that's what is affirmation i hope khadija your answer is clear like for you the answer is there any other question can we get the recording yes you can get the uh, recording will be in the whatsapp itself it will be in the voice so early morning when you open the whatsapp you will find 
the recording and next day if you want to be the leader you can be the leader you can record and you can upload there ma'am regarding mentors uh, their introduction will be done tomorrow or today itself or at least then uh, the mentors have already introduced themselves in this yeah, good evening ma'am mentors have already introduced themselves yeah. and uh, the presentation i have shown you i am going to share this uh, pdf in the group so that you can go through again and again who is your mentor and how is the mentor if all the mentors are there in the group in that lead house okay so they will be introduced tomorrow ma'am no but they have introduced themselves today they all are here in this hall like mr nara is here i am here mahindran is here ram is here rahul is here all all of us are here okay 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 so if you want to convey any message in the to the mentors you just write in the group at nara then i sir i want this or at halima i want this or at rihana i want this so then we will respond back to you okay any other question ma'am uh, group wise mentors will not be there all we can uh, contact anyone anytime or group wise like you Actually, have uh... group wise mentors will be helpful when we are sometimes we are giving the challenge for the group okay like today's challenge has to be done in the team then there you have to contact the mentor and mentor should be the part of that challenge of that uh, particular task but if every day we are giving the individual task because initially we will be give, giving you in individual tasks like everybody has to do separately so there you have to do the task on your own but when there is a group activity the mentor will come and mentor will coordinate and the mentor will facilitate how to do the task in the group And thank then, you ma'am okay and then mentor wise we have already planned the days that on first may which mentor will be taking the session that you will get right now i am going to share on your email the general in the general all the information is there about the mentors that who is going to be on which day and ma'am general we will fill it online or we have to keep um, hard copy Uh, it's up to you if you want it is convenient for you to make hard copy and then write then you can scan and send to us on 29th because we are going to check your gender on 29th and otherwise it is in the drive you can directly type in the drive only so that we can look at your general on weekly basis also but when you are receiving on the mail please don't start writing in the same first make a copy and then write uh i was actually traveling from mali to hulu mali so that's why uh, i was asking about the recording of today's session is it okay to give yes yes it will be there it is 100% it will be shared in the group itself just after 10 minutes of this session you will get the recording thank you thank you very much okay so everything depends on the challenge you know these challenges are going to be very very challenging for you and that is the basis of the learning from there the learning starts so please wait for the challenges till tomorrow and then you will understand in a better way the whole concept okay yes, and uh, for male um, uh, today i was a little bit confused like male what time it is starting for evening and the morning 7:30 from for maldives 7:30 evening and 5:30 morning yeah that was the confusion i thought it is 8 o'clock yeah okay. Uh, okay yeah i understood i understood today is the first day so that's why this type of confusion is always there yeah okay then thank you very much everyone if there is no question because for one month we are going to be there in this you will get the challenge of interviewing each other you will get the challenge of contacting each other you will get the challenge of expressing your feelings for others there are so many things that you will be doing Uh, within this group so by the time like as days will pass you will explore many more things about each other so let some things be there for the other days not everything we have to explore today itself about the team about the course about everything so there has to be some suspense as, as well for other days okay thank you very much okay thank you so now you know every you, tomorrow is a labor day and every labor wants to get the uh, money or to get, get to get the return not money return so one i have a question one laborer has already worked with you all just give the points in the um, chatting box okay, okay.
Okay. How many points would you like to give today's session? Okay. Right in the chat box. Yes, somebody has some question, please go ahead. Yes, Madina is asking, the everyday challenge that we'll be having is, is, is going to have uh, the, uh, the challenge, the affirmation, and the, uh, uh, what did you say again? Affirmation is not the challenge. Affirmation is something that we have to start the day with. That is oh, okay. to make our minds positive throughout the day. So that is not a challenge. Challenge you will get in the group. There will okay. be there will be a video or otherwise there will be write-ups that you have to read and understand and do on your own. That is the thing. That is the best thing. The challenges have to be done on your own as per your understanding. Okay. 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 Then after that, after that, then we will write our affirmation. Yes, just after affirmation, you will receive uh, okay. the challenge between six to seven. I don't know okay. what is Nigeria time, but I think Nigeria time is 2.30 to 3.30. Yeah, in the yeah. afternoon it will be. Okay. Okay, okay. thank you everyone. Thank you. Thank you, ma'am. Thank you so much. Thank you. Yes, Mr. Nara, Thank you. Very well done. Very well done. We're looking forward to tomorrow. Good night. Yes. Good night, everyone. Take care. Okay. And, and this is our lead house family. Please remember everybody in your prayers, in your duas, in your blessings. God bless us all. Thank you. Good night. Good night. Thank you, ma'am.